wildlife enthusiasts. Prepare to embark on an exciting adventure into the remarkable world of koalas. Koalas, those or inducing marsupials, are undeniably one of Australia's most famous critters. These fluffy wonders have a magical power to melt even the iciest of hearts in a mere moment. And as a proud Aussie, let me tell you, they hold a special place in our hearts. But hold on tight, because despite their worldwide popularity and their adorable presence on Aussie souvenirs, there are some seriously basic facts about these iconic mammals that might surprise you. Brace yourself for these 10 mind-boggling and witty facts about koalas. Koalas aren't bears, they're marsupials. First things first, let's clear the air. Koalas aren't bears. Despite their teddy bear-like appearance, these charming animals belong to a unique group of marsupials. They share their marsupial family tree with kangaroos and wombats. So, while they may look like bears, they're far more special than that. Marsupials are mammals whose offspring are born undeveloped and are left to grow in a pouch in the mother's belly. So, given the fact that they are marsupials, they are more related to kangaroos and wombats than they are to bears. Koalas can be found in southeastern and eastern Australia. If you are yearning to catch a glimpse of a koala in the wild, you'll have to venture down under. These marvelous marsupials call southeastern and eastern Australia their home. From eucalyptus forests to coastal regions, you'll find these fuzzy wonders high up in the trees, living their tree-hugging dreams. While koalas are a national symbol of Australia's unique wildlife, they can only be found in the wild on the southeast and eastern sides of Australia, along the coastlines of Queensland, New South Wales, South Australia and Victoria. They live high up in eucalyptus trees of native bushlands and forests, usually perched between the forks of the tree's branches. Joeys are very attached to their mammals. Baby koalas are too cute and are called joeys. Just like human babies, koala joeys are deeply attached to their mammals. After being born, these little bundles of joy crawl into their mother's pouches, where they spend the first six to seven months of their lives. As they grow, joeys hitch rides on their mother's backs until they're ready to explore the world on their own. As marsupials, their babies, joeys, are born very premature and continue to develop in their mother's sack. These deaf, blind, and furless babies rely on their well-developed senses of smell, touch, and an inborn sense of direction to feel their way to the pouch, where they attach themselves to a teat. Once attached, the teat swells in their mouth, fusing them to their food source so that their mother can move freely. They spend about six months in the pouch, and then another six months or so riding on her abdomen or back, and they stay with their mothers until another joey is born, typically one to three years. They have a very supportive butt. Believe it or not, koalas have a built-in cushion for their long tree-dwelling adventures. Their posterior is equipped with extra padding, a bony structure called the cartilaginous butt. This unique adaptation helps them comfortably sit on branches for extended periods and avoids discomfort during their lazy, koala-style naps. Living in trees and being wedged between rough branches requires a lot of support. Luckily, the koala has strong cartilage at the end of their curved spine, allowing them to make eucalyptus trees a comfortable home. Koala means, no drink. Ever wondered what the word, koala, means? In the Australian Aboriginal language, it is believed to translate to, no drink. This name pays homage to the fact that koalas receive most of their hydration from the eucalyptus leaves they munch on, rather than drinking water directly. And in fact, koalas don't need to drink much water because of the moisture they get from munching on juicy eucalyptus leaves all day. However, they can and do drink from creeks and water holes if necessary, especially during heat waves and in times of drought but if you see a koala drinking, it's probably in distress. They're fussy eaters. When it comes to their diet, koalas are quite particular. They have a taste for eucalyptus leaves, which happen to be toxic to most animals. These furry food connoisseurs, however, have a specialized digestive system that allows them to break down the toxins and extract nutrients from their leafy feast. Their special fiber digesting organ, called a cacum, helps to detoxify the chemicals in the leaves. 
Though, mature males tend to have a stronger, muskier odor, females and juvenile males give off a slight eucalyptus smell, which doubles as a natural insect repellent. However, they can be quite picky eaters. Although there are around 700 species of eucalyptus trees, koalas tend to only eat from 50 of those. In fact, individual koalas usually have one to three specific eucalyptus species that they will eat regularly, reserving others for the occasional snack or resting spot. And even then, they'll often choose leaves at the top of the tallest trees that contain more liquid and nutrients, only the best for Australia's koalas. Koalas can sleep up to 20 hours a day. If you thought your cat was the sleep champion, think again. To put that in perspective, there are only 24 hours in a day, meaning koalas can sleep for about three quarters of that. There was a widely circulated rumor that they sleep so much because they got high off eucalyptus leaves which is their main diet. However, while it sounds plausible, this rumor has been confirmed false. Despite the rumors, koalas don't get high or drugged out on eucalyptus leaves. The reason they sleep so much is because they are naturally lazy and the eucalyptus leaves are very low in nutrients that koalas need more sleep than most animals. So, they sleep for that long, to conserve some energy. Koala chlamydia is a serious disease. Unfortunately, it's not all sunshine and eucalyptus leaves for koalas. They face a grave threat called koala chlamydia, which is an infectious disease affecting their reproductive organs. But it's not the same strain of chlamydia that affects humans. This illness has had a severe impact on koala populations, leading to infertility and even death in some cases. Conservation efforts are crucial in combating this disease and preserving the future of these beloved marsupials. Many koala populations are vulnerable to chlamydia and it usually manifests when they're in stressful situations. The disease can also cause blindness. Koalas have unique fingerprints. Did you know that koalas have their own set of fingerprints, just like humans? These adorable creatures possess distinct ridges on their paws, making each koala's fingerprint truly one of a kind. They have fingerprints unique to each and every one of them. Much like human beings, they also have thumbs except they have two thumbs and three fingers on each hand. So, next time you spot a koala, remember that you are encountering an animal with its own unique identity. Sadly, koala numbers are on the decline. Despite their undeniable charm, koala populations are facing a worrisome decline. Loss of habitat, bushfires, and the spread of diseases have taken a toll on their numbers. Many koala populations are faced with nowhere to go when their forest habitat is destroyed by deforestation. Just in the last two years, tree clearing has tripled in New South Wales, leaving important koala habitats incredibly fragmented or completely lost. With their trees gone, koalas are spending more time on the ground in search of food and shelter. Sadly, this is when they're most vulnerable to being hit by vehicles, attacked by dogs and falling ill to stress-induced diseases like chlamydia. As a result of all these growing pressures, in early 2022, koalas were officially uplisted to endangered in Queensland, NSW and the ACT. And there you have it, friends. The top 10 mind-blowing facts about the incredible wild koalas. These marsupial marvels have proven time and again that they're more than just adorable, fuzzy creatures. From their misleading bear-like appearance to their unique fingerprints, koalas continue to captivate our imaginations. But let's not forget the challenges they face. Koala chlamydia and habitat loss threaten their very existence. It's up to us to raise awareness, support conservation efforts, and ensure a brighter future for these tree-hugging wonders. So, the next time you find yourself in the southeastern and eastern regions of Australia, keep your eyes peeled for these eucalyptus-munching, sleep-loving, and fiercely adorable koalas. And remember, they may not be bears, but they certainly know how to bear the weight of our admiration. Stay wild, stay curious, and keep exploring the incredible world of wildlife. And that concludes our showcase of the today's topic. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to share this video with your friends, family, and relatives so that they too can enjoy videos on wild animals. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.